see Pooch, man. You getting the right to donate? Just walk right in. Yeah, they're gonna open the door for you. What you donating? That's what's up. That's what's up, right? Check y'all out. We got some stuff for y'all. Oh, the hook on fire. Okay. Yeah, I might need that. <laughs> <laughs> got some hooks on fire. Some other books. Coach, how you feel, brother? I'm good, brother. Surviving. How you doing? Man, I'm wonderful. Got some books. Everybody can't just do video games all day. That's right. Yeah, I mean, everybody don't play video games. I, I've been hearing a lot video games and, you know, toys and things. That's cool. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. CD, Christmas CD. Okay. Just to give the adults. What stores you know, you scratch the sun, come up inside of it, and then pop the door and start letting people in. I got work to do. So who's all this stuff going to? Toys for Tots. So it's going to be distributed through uh, three counties. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we're focused now. We're not having one. But what I was saying, man, you can, um, you know, turn it on for like five, ten minutes, heat it up. Tyson Gravity came down. He just donated over 100 children's books. It's a That's right. And I think it's great, man, because, you know, we need toys, but we also need books. Now, Tyson, tell me, why was it important for you to give them books? Well, we think that it's important that we stay educated in the, in, as well as, you know, clothed and fed. And there's a lot of toys out here, and a lot of people do play the video games and things like that. But you need to know how to read the instructions to play the video games anyway. So we think it's important to stay, you know, well read. Now, your store is doing very well up there in the North Philly side of Erie Avenue, right? Broad and Erie. Right on Broad and Erie. Why do you think you guys are doing so good nowadays? Well, we stay in touch with the community. Just like y'all guys. You know, you hear a need, you go out there and you service the need. It's not just about going out there making money. We feed people on Fridays. If, if that's the case, if we can afford it, then you can come down Broad and Erie and get a meal for absolutely nothing. Tonight, tonight we, we support local artists always. Tonight we have a battle going on. You know, we have a showcase down at Trocadero next Thursday. I mean, it's just a lot of things that we do within the community that other stores wouldn't do because we're not just a store. We're here for you. That's right, man. It's probably Tyson's in the street as much as I am. Every time I'm out, I'm always seeing that bright, what's that, bright neon green truck? Neon green truck. I might change that color, though, man. I don't know. It's blind me every time I see it. But you notice it every time it comes. And that's a great marketing tool. You see it on the parking wars and everything. It's there. Neon green. That's right. going nowhere. Now you you stay in the community. Look how the community cats come out and donate these toys. How does it make you feel? Well, I expect to see a full bus of toys from the community because a lot of people, you know, on the news they put the negative publicity on us, but being out in the street and talking to people and you see that people genuinely have a heart. You expect to see this, you know, and we expect to see we should have three or four buses out here. But you know, people really do have a heart out there, no matter what they say out there, you know? 
Right, man. We're now what? 65% for us? That's about, man. But we need to be at 100. All right, man. So, Tice One, thank you for coming out, man. It's Boots, man. Izzo down here live. Toys for Ty Drive, man. It's 1.3 to beat. Thank you. Thank you. Man, we tried to be involved with whatever. I think so. Record. Um, you better have, um, what book am I looking for? Come on, why you want to do this? Mom, right what book am I looking for? Don't say something I already got, because no, I'm going to be mad at you. you. don't have it. What I is it? Which Three. one? Three. <laughs> I know you got the other one there. My friend said you got it up here, but I've been out. I've been sick. I've been out West Philly. That's why I ain't been up there. My house put on fire. Call me. I deliver, and I'll mail it out. Get it Fire. What did you do not hear? Sorry. Fire. <laughs> I'm at the Red when Cross. The, you're at the Red Cross right now? Yeah, Ooh. I'm at the Red Cross. She's at the Red Cross, <laughs> but donate. Her house caught on fire. She's at the Red Cross and she's still donating toys. Hey, it's not, it's not nothing. You're making a big deal. I'm not making a big deal. That's still nice as hell. It's people that make millions of dollars and ain't donating nothing. But it's a lot of people that's out there in the worst situation than I am. I still got three jobs. I still got a roof over my kids' head. I'm just waiting for the insurance company to get the hunt on my home. I'm not going home. I'm not going to make the same home, but I'm going to make home. That's still the nicest thing I heard all day. <laughs> see? You see why I do what I do? It's not about the paper. I couldn't. Come get me. I got your book. I got your book. I put the store. You come up with the store, I got you.